Hi everyone, this tutorial is on Swift Playgrounds in the Learn to Code 1 Playground and I'm going to be going over the toggling a switch uh, section here on our Swift program. So I think that the biggest thing was with this one uh, right now is that they are introducing us to a brand new topic and uh, if we read the directions on the left hand side it says a switch might be toggled open or closed. Closed switches are off and awaiting activation, and open switches are on and show a light inner core, and you can see that it is lit up if it's already open. And this is the, a pretty big topic in Swift is uh, the switch. And so they're introducing this for the first time. We already learned about gems in the last one. So now the next goal is learning how to toggle a switch. Okay, so I'm gonna start my coding here. It looks like I need to move forward uh, to go down the steps there, and it looks like that's going to take a total of two times to, to get to the bottom tile next to the gem. And it looks like it's to my right, but if I turn it and put myself in the perspective of Byte, uh, it's actually to his left. So I am going to need to make a left-hand turn because you always need to put yourself in the perspective of the Byte character. And so a turn left is going to simply move me or just get me in the direction of the gem. So I need to move forward to actually get to the gem, as we see here. And once I'm on a gem, our goal is always to collect the gem. So now I'm going to have it collect the gem once I'm there. And after I collect the gem, I need to move forward to get to the next set of stairs. That's another left-hand turn to face going up the steps. It's going to take me two steps to get to the switch, and if I did that correctly here, let's run it a little faster, I should be collecting the gem, moving forward, turning left, moving forward two times now. The last step, when we get to a switch that isn't toggled, we simply turn it on. We wanna open it up and turn it on by toggling it. So I hit toggle, let's run that, and let's see if everything is run to perfection. And so there you have it. That is how you toggle a switch. Thanks for watching.